Ah, yeah, yeah. Wanna travel south this year. And I ask you to subscribe to San Joaquin News Network. San Joaquin News Network be putting out good stuff. All right, what up, people? How you, how you doing? How you doing? I'm your daddy. I'm your father. I'm not really your daddy or your father, but I like saying that I'm your daddy and I'm your father. Anyway, this is San Joaquin's new San Joaquin News Network. YouTube's been messing with him. He asked for support. I should give him more support than I do. Also, subscribe to the Police Accountability Report. It's in the description. Anyway, here we go. Guy at the post office, snowflake can't handle it, comes outside. What's going on here? Let's watch this. I'm going to be interrupting a lot. If you don't like it, if you don't like to hear me, go to San Joaquin's News, News Network and watch the video for yourself. The Postal Service is a joke. Can I have you put that away, please? Um, Postal Service does... A better than average job in my opinion but they are government funded and again when government's running something it basically fails and they and they and it can fail over and over and over again because it gets bailed out by the taxpayer i'm not in your face we're gonna live stream you to my uh, youtube channel no, no. sir you need to turn this off we're gonna you you have no you have no right <laughs> no oh, this dude just panics to do this. I, I don't wait, wait a minute. You have no right to I'm be on on All right. Those are spoilers people put up. I hate when they put up spoilers, man. Uh so again, subscribe to him. Again, Americans are so dumb. Especially government employees. What are you basing your actions on? Because you're uncomfortable and you're a snowflake? How you th how do you think you could just walk up to someone, not doing anything to anyone, and walk up and put your stuff and your hand in their face? Are you more are you a moron or what, dude? Face, please turn off the camera. Why is that? Okay. I need you to turn off the camera. Are you are you the I need you to ease some nutsack. Police! Are you the manager or the postmaster? Oh, I need you to- Go to Turn that off right now. You do not have my- The poly poo poo. Permission to show that. You do not have permission to videotape on government property. What a moron. Again, this is who the government hires. This is all the government can get. Because no respectable person wants to go work for the parasitic government. They want to earn their own keep. Um, where- Call the Postal Inspection Service. Um, where- where's- Please turn that- can you, can you Call the NAACP! Call the NFL! Call the KKK! Call the, uh, ACLU! Call the New York Times and call the Washington Mooney Times! Show me something that states that's off paper or something? Dude, you got your face- you got your I hand- have, No, I you have my- your... I have this covering your camera! He's actually breaking the law now by, uh, uh, Violating San Joaquin's rights, Dave, I believe his name is. He's violating his rights by blocking, obstructing his First Amendment right. What a moron. Not only does he not know what he's talking about, then he breaks the law. I need you to turn that off. I, 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 I am I'm requesting you to turn that off. Are you the postmaster? I'm, I'm requesting you to go eat a nutsack. Requesting you to turn off the postmaster. Camera. I need to see the You're postmaster. Not. That's fine. The, the, We're going to live stream you to my uh, YouTube channel. No, no, sir, you need to turn this off. We're gonna, you, you have no... <laughs> His voice is trembling. My goodness, what a snowflake. No right to do this. <laughs> I don't wait. He has no right to do this. Have you ever read the first law on the books in this country in your life? The first law on the books is his right to do what he's doing, you moron. Wait a minute, though, no right I'm on public, government property. I'm on public property. This no, is the sidewalk this is and the lobby. Property. The lobby is open to the public. Did you record in the lobby? I recorded. Uh, I didn't.
Poster 7, biatch. Or any personal stuff from anybody. Did that's, you record that's, in the lobby? Dude, do you think I didn't do my homework before I came here? I I've, done, I'm I've, just done, you a I've done quite a few post, post offices, and you're making this one look very bad, my friend. You're going to be on YouTube. You're going to have about 30,000 people watching you in the next couple days. So just chill, dude. I'm just not, relax. Talk no, to me like a person. I am talking. I did try no, to No, you came out all up in my face. Oh, my God. Coming out, saying turn that off, acting like you have authority over another person that you don't, Breaking the law by obstructing the view of his camera and making unlawful requests and then putting his life in danger by calling guys with guns. Nah. Yeah, you came up real nice. Stuck your hand in my face. You're no, pretty I, much I, punched I, me, dude. I, I pretty much if I wouldn't have backed up, you would have hit me. I, with what? Your hand and that paper. Okay. That's fine. But the only thing is, look, I'm trying to teach you guys and us how to record public officials and keep everybody accountable. You're gonna look bad if you don't straighten up, dude. Straight up. That, there was a DHS memo that was passed out to all federal buildings. We are allowed, if we're allowed in public, we're allowed to take photographs and we're allowed to videotape. You're not allowed inside to these areas. Not where there's yes, he is, dummy. And that's only a discretion with the postmaster. If he feels that I have violated somebody's I uh, ask for permission to walk inside the postal office, and, I've, and dude, I purchased a stamp. No, I'm just asking. So I'm here on business, my ask? friend. No, that's fine. I'm not, I'm, if I've done my stamp, homework, my friend. But, but I didn't. I did not videotape any personal. Stuff. I didn't tape anybody's personal stuff. And that's what that's what is we're not supposed to do. And I know what I'm supposed to do and what I'm not supposed to do. But today you're gonna learn a lesson. A learning. Can't be difficult. A lesson. A lesson in the First Amendment. Here comes bootlicker. On the sidewalk. He came up to him, moron. Nobody was bothering anybody until the guy in this frame right here with the paperwork in front of his stupid face came up and started something. And then immediately you take his side for what reason? Another moron passing by on the sidewalk. Dude, the First Amendment. This is America, my friend. First Amendment, yeah. dumbass. No, you don't need dumbass. the public. You don't need to curse. Well, he, he's, he, he, cursed, he cursed at me first. You don't need that. He cursed at me you first. You have your ability to... The uh, First Amendment. Have you heard the First Amendment? So. Have you heard the First Amendment? What's that? Have you? It's hilarious. Anytime you bring up the Constitution or your Bill of Rights to government employees, they go into this weird, awkward silence like... Eh, eh, does not compute malfunction 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 you have no right to record government property government pr private private eh, 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 eh. you think i don't know my rights man you're mistaken even when the cops come they're gonna they're gonna uh, give you a little bit of education okay i i, I love it. today you're gonna learn the first amendment and you know what's going on? All, all, with all the terrorism and all that stuff that's going on, they, they take away our rights. And if we don't fight for our rights, we don't have any rights. Does that make sense to you? I have, I have retired police officers. I have military men that follow my YouTube channel. They donate. They love what I do because I'm standing up to tyranny. What are you afraid of a camera for? There's no reason to be afraid of a camera. Right or wrong? I do this all the time. I do all the federal in federal installations. I do police stations. I do all of that, man. I never have to show ID. This is a First Amendment Constitution, dude. This is a protected act. Did you know that in 2010 there was a DHS memo that went out to all these institutions, these federal installations, stating that we could do this? Did you know that? Thor? Tries to cover it up. Stephen, Stefan, Stefan K. Blanton. Stephen Blanton. Stephen Blanton. Uh, it doesn't say which post office, but there you go. Stephen Blanton. You wanted to be on camera. There you go. What do you got to hide, man? I already got it. I can't do this and I know my rights now he's hiding his badge look at it. he's hiding his badge and for what you're gonna get 
an education today, man. I bet I could change that to say something else in my screenshot. What do you think? I think I think I can make this say something else. is I can go to the White House in Area 51 and they don't even get as crazy as you did. This is 4K, so I'm gonna get you real close up on your face. Get all those wrinkles and those gray hairs. You're a nice guy. The ball hit. You're a nice guy too, coming out and bothering people that aren't breaking any laws, you moron. Yours. You got all up in my face, dude. I did. All I ask you to do is... You got all up in my face, man. I ask you to turn off your camera. You refuse. You got all up in my face, man. Why should he turn off his camera, moron? That's the part that isn't sinking in. You turn off your camera, you refuse. I don't have to turn off my camera. This is my this is my First Amendment right. You can't be recording, taking, potentially taking customer's information. What an idiot. Now, nah, again, he's doing the same things cops do, trying to form a narrative that didn't really happen. I didn't do none of that, man. If you, you, think if you, didn't, have, if you, if you didn't have a problem with it? Hey, you think I haven't done this before? It's Come on, irrelevant. man. It's irrelevant. Come on, man. It's irrelevant. Did you see me take anybody's personal if information? someone tells me that that's what you Did somebody doing, tell you? Yes, someone told me that. That I took their personal information. That is correct. Oh. He's lying. The only reason why, got, why do you hey, think I came out? I got proof that I did it. I got proof that I did it. I'm glad you I got proof that I did it. I bet you do. Some, they want to for the postal service. He's gonna the post do the oh, here, here's where he says that the post office is funded by the sale of stamps only. He's gonna be funded by he's gonna he, purchase of stamps, dude. I can show you some stuff. The post uh, any money for the postal service. So I can comment on that, Mr. Ahead, President. Oh, so, so we authorized in the last CARE Act uh, over $10 billion of a loan. Uh, my team is already actively working on that with the Postal Service if they need the money, and we're, we're dealing with that. The Postal Service is a joke. We teach you a lesson. We don't get tax dollars. This has nothing to do with tax dollars. It's all right, man. Privately funded by the same stamps and products. Privately funded. Yeah, we'll see about that. <laughs> Every post office is getting audited. That. You're, you're working right now. You don't have that right as I do. So now he's following him, trying to get his name. Don't you get it? San Joaquin is educating this guy. Wait. Aren't waiting for the police. All right. Now we got okay. had, 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 People have had to resign. Because now here come the two swine that don't know the law either. What a shocker. But thank God Dave, San Joaquin Transparency, knows and isn't scared to stand up for his rights because these cops try to control him like a like a slave at first and he doesn't have it. Doesn't have any of it. Uh, no, no, I'm just recording, doing my First Amendment activity. Okay. And this guy came out, got all, all through my face, acting crazy. Said I couldn't record. I went inside the mail, uh, the post office. I purchased a stamp, so I'm officially there on business. And uh, I'm just practicing my First Amendment rights. Okay. What's yep. your name and badge number? Officer Inspector. Inspector 1302. 1302. And you are Mesa 1250. Thank you guys. Uh, I don't care if you record. Can right. You just, can you set it down? Let no. No thanks. Leave me alone. Non-consensual. What the hell is that thing? Is that a flashlight? No, no, no. no I can't. No, I can't do that. Because it could be used as a weapon. No, it's oh, here we go. Can you put all your weapons down, coward? How about you back away from me? Back away from me if you think I'm going to strike you with a camera. I use a camera to record. Do you record with your gun? No. Use it what it's for. And you have no reason to think he's going to strike you. And if you're scared, back up, coward. Enough with the cops blaining. Dude, I, I got two. I, I got to patch you down hey, for my You're being live streamed, so don't act up. That's fine. We're, uh, right. Look it. I got... I, I got... Uh, Put it down. No thanks. I don't know. You can smash no, wait, it against it, my partner's it, head. So. Um, it, uh, you could murder me like you guys do. Th kill three three Americans a day. You could falsely imprison me like you do every single day. You could lie in your report like you do every single day. 
There is much more to be feared by the two armed costume gunmen than there is with the guy who's unarmed carrying a camera. You're a moron, and you're doing it live on YouTube. Am I being detained? At this point, yes. I'm being detained. Denied is being detained for no reason, no lawful reason. So they're, they're illegally detaining me for, uh, for no, my First Amendment constitutional... No, for investigation. We're trying to figure out what's going on. Okay, is that... A investigation into what crime? Misdemeanor or felony? It doesn't matter if it's a misdemeanor or a felony. Well, it does matter because under Terry v. Ohio and most of the state's ID laws, you must have, let's see, yeah, have, is, or about to be committing a crime, which you have no evidence of any of that. So to detain him before you have evidence of any of that would be unlawful detainment. Punk, pig, coward. Um, so what are you detaining me for? We don't know exactly what happened in there. That, yeah, find out. Get your reasonable, articulable suspicion of a crime, and then you can detain. I like how they, they put the cart before the horse on almost every stop. What do you mean you don't know what happened in there? Yeah. I got so everything If you don't know, that means you have no evidence of a crime. Therefore, you're detaining me for no legitimate, objective reason. We got a call in the post office that there's a the disturbance and all that, so we haven't talked to them. Dude, about. I didn't tell yeah, them. Yeah, well, go, go talk to the people that called you, moron. Quit pretending like I'm going to smash a camera on your head, even though you deserve it, for being that stupid. So in the meantime, we're going to go talk to them. We're going to go talk to him here now. He we're going to talk to them. We're talking to you we'll first. We'll go talk to them, dude. I'm not All doing right? anything illegal. He didn't call you, nor does he want to talk to you, punk. So quit trying to force yourself on him like rapists do to women. I'm not putting anything down. I'm not doing anything. Who is that guy that got busted and famous in the Me Too movement, the dude that made all the movies? Uh, I know what. Harvey something. Weinstein? Cops are like the Weinsteins of the street. The Harvey Weinsteins of America are police. Illegal. If you guys detain me, it's unlawfully because you guys cannot articulate. You guys don't have rads on me. So you guys can't articulate a, a reasonable suspicion that I committed a crime. I've been, I, I'm doing what I'm supposed to do. You can articulate. It depends on what they say. Uh, so. Well, go see what they say then, moron. Why don't you do that first? Go talk to the people that called you. And get the evidence of a crime. And then you could detain for reasonable, articulable suspicion of a crime. Right now you're just being an idiot. And acting like an imbecile. Well, well, they, well, well go, go talk to them. Tell hey, us, so go talk to them. If they, I've uh, done nothing wrong, man. Hey, well, until we talk to them, we don't You're know. being live streamed. You're being seen by quite a few people. That's fine. It's not the first time. I know, man. So. But you see the problem? The problem with today is... uh. All this terrorism and everything. Look, man, I don't have nothing on me. I have no I weapons. I have no ill intent. I'm not going to use... Huh? No, no, you can't search me, dude. I won't let you. If you want to search me, if I'm you, you. you want to search me, you can go ahead, but it's, I'm not going to let That's you. That's what I'm asking you. I'm not going to let you. No, no, no. If you do it, you're, 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 you're violating my rights, man. At this point, I invoke... I mean, they can't wait to violate your rights. First Amendment, Fourth Amendment, Fifth Amendment rights. Dude, this is my first. This isn't my first rodeo, bro. Just like you. It's not mine. Okay, right. this. I'm, I'm if it's not your first rodeo, piglet. Then why are you acting stupid and don't know what you're doing and don't know the ID laws and don't know uh, you're trying to unlawfully detain someone before you have any evidence of any crime? If it's not your first rodeo, how many more rodeos is it going to take, there, dummy? How many more rodeos are you going to go to before you learn the law that you were hired to uphold? I'm, I'm, you're, I'm, you're not the first I'm, guy. On I'm the protected. Street I'm protected the by this. In our faces, so. I know. I'm no, stupid. You walked up to his camera. Nobody put a camera in your face. The first moron who was acting just like you walked up and put his face in the camera. And then you two morons came and put your stupid faces in his camera. Not the other way around. Everything you say and do is backwards. Protected by this, dude. And let me ask you this Did you sign, did you sign an oath to protect my rights? There we go. Back to the Constitution. Back to robot malfunction. Awkward silence. Can't understand the words. Anything that has to do with the Bill of Rights or Constitution. Did you? Did you sign an oath to protect my rights, man? Yeah. All right, then. All right. Do you have anything for us? I don't have anything for you guys. Okay. You're free to go. So it was an unlawful detainment. What do you mean he's free to go? Why was he being detained to begin with? What articulable evidence did you have of a crime? Nothing. You're cowards. You acted just like the snowflake, butthurt cowards in the post office because you all work 
and, and live under the same religion of we're government, so we're God, so we're above you, so we're better. We wear shiny costumes and bandages, and, uh, and these blue sovereigns have weapons to kill you with, and they kill three Americans a day. You guys kill three Americans a day. You do not have the moral high ground. You lie incessantly. You do not have the moral high ground. You are beneath us. And not only are you beneath us, you're far, far beneath us, both intellectually, physically, and in generally speaking, as far as life goes. And you can keep trying to force your guns down our throats, but that's not going to change any type of respect we have for you. You want respect? Act like a public servant, not like a stupid pig coward. Those are your options, pig. Take them or leave them. Good job, San Joaquin Transparency, San Joaquin's News Network, San Joaquin News Network, San Joaquin Transparency, San Joaquin Valley Transparency, San Joaquin, San Joaquin. Also, please, please, please subscribe to the Police Accountability Report. The link is in the description. Let's build the Police Accountability Report. They want to have us on as auditors patriots and have like an auditor summit so please click in the description real quick and subscribe to the police accountability report and tell them i sent you tell taya and steve that i sent you thanks so much for watching my channel and hit up my etsy store also in the description get yourself a nice ring or a nice knife i just made a beautiful damascus knife all right everyone peace and tranquility thanks for watching bye